to the average Joe. We'll take you where you need to go. There's plenty of excitement here, so come explore with us. We can always show you something new from theme parks to restaurant reviews. So join us at the average Joe Florida. Hey folks, welcome to The Average Joe. Today we are our second day of the Orlando Informer event here at Universal Studios. And tonight we're gonna hang around, I think, Islands of Adventure. We're in Hogsmeade. Just got off the train from Universal Studio. These studios. You see the castle back there, Hogwarts Castle. Three broomsticks to see what food they've got tonight for Orlando Informer. Let's see what they've got. So you can use the trays, which is nice. First stop for the night with the three broomsticks in Hogsmeade, and the food platters are ginormous to say the least. That's ribs and chicken and fries and corn. That is, yep, you got a salad. You got a salad. I can get one of those. That's a shepherd's pie. That's an apple pie for two, easily. And then you got actual butterbeer ice cream in the container. This is a tremendous amount of food. Oh, and you got warm butterbeer, and I got sweet tea and lemonade with an Arnold Palmer. We're gonna dig in and try the food. That shepherd's pie is steaming hot inside. You can see the steam coming off it. That's really good shepherd's pie. That's nice. And they had all the butter beers. They had frozen, regular, and warm butter beer up there too. Plus the butter beer ice cream that you got. How are the ribs? <laughs> they the are so good. It's nice. Mm. You get more if you want them. Orlando Informer is a great event. Just in trying different food, you normally know, wouldn't try. I would never order ribs at a theme park. It wouldn't cross my mind, but it's nice to be able to try them all. It's so good. How's that apple pie? Delicious. It is very good. I just had a huge apple pie. The amount of cinnamon in there is incredible. It's huge. There's always too yeah. so much to eat, that's for sure. They they should have made smaller ones this event or something, but between that, you can't eat all the uh the uh shepherd pie. You can't eat all the shepherd's pie. No, it's just a lot of food, so and uh one thing they do, just to give you guys a heads up, one thing the average Joe always says, if you want to make an apple pie he doesn't like, you put raisins in it. So, but it's a great apple pie. Unfortunately, it does have raisins in it. So just be prepared for that if you're not a raisin fan. But other than that, it is delicious. They have the Hogwarts castle all projected. We're not here for the Christmas show, unfortunately. That was earlier. Look at that, they have the snow and everything projected on the castle. It's really nice up there, doesn't it? That's really cool. Another shot of the castle, Hogwarts castle. It's very beautiful. If you did miss us, don't worry, we'll be out a bit later. Not as we enter into Jurassic Park, the Lost Continent. And now you can bid her too. Here's our chance to meet Blue the Velociraptor. There's Blue. There's Blue. You're too cute to die. I don't want to No, go backwards. Yeah, there you go. And bring that, bring that this way just a little bit. I gotcha, yep. And my friend in the red shirt, can you tell Blue that it's a selfie and she'll smile big? <laughs> there we go. Good job. Let's get Thank down, you. friends. That was Hi. blue with Velociraptor. Where are you inching from? I know it's dark. We have a pretzel with cream cheese. No, not cream cheese. We have a pretzel with cheddar cheese. And I have a pino colata, icy, from the stand right over here in Jurassic Park. Kind of blurry. It's dark. But that's a pina colata. Not a colada. And that's a pretzel. And now we have found key lime cheesecake at the Big Dig restaurant here. They have burgers and stuff in there too, I guess, or chicken? Uh, they had chicken. Chicken and corn on the cob. Oh, okay. That kind of food. But it's right over here. And they had key lime cheesecake, which is what you got there. And there we go, Orlando Informer on the netting for the Hulk Coaster. We've had a great time tonight. Ate a lot of food, rode some rides tonight, it was fun. No weights on anything walk on. It was pretty cool. Well, thanks to the Orlando Informer. It's a great event. If you're in the Orlando area and having one of these, highly worth the price, that's for sure. Orlando Informer. Link down below. A Hulk Coaster. They'll be coming right at us. Very cool. 
Not my kind of ride. Here's an example of the wait times during one of these events. The longest wait is the Velocicoaster so far, 30 minutes. Yeah, that's awesome. It's nice low wait times. It's Christmas in Seuss Landing, or Grinchmas as they call it. Let's go check out Grinchmas. So another one of the, there's another one of those trees on this side over here. How's that Grinch? <laughs> Let's see if we can find a real Grinch. Can you sound like a circus organ? The trolley train can How about you? Can you go Whistling breeze on the flying trapeze! Float zoom zoom! Sounding all trappy! How about you? Can you go? When the trolley train goes rolling past, we know how it sounds to go really fast! With a swish, swoosh, complex! Now don't you be last! Make the sound of fast! Swish, swoosh, collapse! Oh, the mighty trolley train makes a loud hullabaloo! It's the sound of fun! Can you make it too? Whee! Like a beach ball, the trolley train is going boing, 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 boing! Boom! Trolley train is a wonder! So that was our ride on the Whoville trolley train. The kids ride, it's fun. It goes above Whoville, shows all over Seuss Landing. 